you like to print your calendars, you're going to love Fantastical. Here I am in the week view in Fantastical, so I'll go up to the file menu and click print. I could also do this by just hitting the keyboard combination command P. Once you do that, it opens this great print preview. And in the print preview, you have control over a lot of settings about the way your printed calendar is going to look. Now currently it's in the week view because that's where I started. It always follows the view. But I can change it if I want, like if I want the day view or the month or the year. And I can do this also with keyboard combinations. So I'll hit Command 4 for the get the year or the list view, which is Command 5. I'm going to go back now to the week view though. And you'll see when I did that, it returns to the current week. And I want to see next week. So I'll go ahead and click Starts Next Week. And I've got this great view again. Now I can change my calendar sets. You know, there's various calendar sets you can use in Fantastical. I can also select and deselect individual calendars. So if I wanted to turn off the Exchange calendar, I would just click this button, and those events would come off, or I could put them back on. Now there's some additional view options as well. You can see all day events, or you can turn them off. For instance, Daylight Savings is here on the 13th. I'll go ahead and click this button, and it'll go away. If I click it, it'll go back. I can also show or hide timed events. And I can even put the calendar week numbers at the top left section of the screen. See, you can see it's there. It's calendar week 11, but I'll turn that off again. There's a nice mini calendar up in the right corner. You can turn that on or off with this toggle. And you even have this nice key showing you the color code for each of the various calendars with events. You can turn that off or on as well in these settings. And if you're going to be printing to black and white calendars, you can click this button and it'll give you a nice preview of how it would look. Uh, you can also change the text size if you like. I'm going to change it back to medium here. And if you want to zoom in, just use this slider. You can zoom in or out. This print view is really great. Uh, for instance, if you want to print out a calendar without any events on it, like you just want a nice monthly calendar, you could set that up in Fantastical. I'll just go to the month view and say hide all day events and timed events. And you've got a nice clean calendar for March that you could write on or print out or do whatever you want with. I'm going to put it all back together now and go back to the week view though, because I think I'm about ready to, to print this calendar. So when I'm ready, I'll click the continue button and that brings up the print button. I just press that button and I print it out of my printer. If I want a PDF version, I can go ahead and click PDF and then save as PDF and I'm good to go. Using Fantastical, printing your calendar has never been easier.